Hi everyone and welcome to another recipe video and this week I'm making Hong Xiao Nu Rou Mian which is a braised beef noodle soup and I'm making it nice and spicy Sichuan style. Yes that's right, I don't just cook and eat desserts, I would literally die if I did. In fact, I wonder how long I could survive on desserts only. Anyway I digress, let's carry on with the recipe. Although you do need a couple of hours to boil the soup, it's actually really easy to whip up. It seems complicated because there are a lot of different ingredients, but at the end of the day they just all go into one pot and then you wait for it to boil. So okay, let's get started. First you need to heat a little flavourless vegetable or groundnut oil in the saucepan. And then you need to brown some chopped beef shin or braising steak. I used 500 grams here. Add one teaspoon of salt, I'm using pink Himalayan here but sea salt will do nicely too. And add two teaspoonfuls of ground five spice powder. Ugh, I hate these little shaky tops at the tops of spice jars. I should have just opened it from the screw top and dug in with the spoon, it's so frustrating. Anyway, you just want to give that a stir until the meat's brown nice and evenly all over. Now we're going to add 800 milliliters of boiling water. And one day I will find a pouring jug that actually pours without spilling water all over the sides. And now I'm adding one stick of cassia bark, one star anise, one black cardamom, six crushed cloves of garlic, and about two centimeters squares of thinly chopped ginger. I'm just going to sprinkle over two teaspoonfuls of citron peppercorns, and add two tablespoonfuls of light soy sauce. Now I'm adding one tablespoonful of citron doubanjang. This is fermented chili bean paste and it makes the soup so fragrant and spicy, I love it. And now we're going to add one tablespoonful of dark brown sugar. Trust me, you need this for the flavour balance, it is gorgeous with it. Don't leave the sugar out. And finally I'm adding in a quartered whole yellow onion. And that's basically it. Now you want to cover it and simmer it over low heat for about 4 hours. And I wish you could smell this, it is absolutely fantastic. When you're just about ready to serve, boil up your favourite noodles. Any wheat noodles will do, my favourite are flat wheat noodles. My favourite ever noodles to eat with this kind of beef noodle soup is dao xiao mian, which means knife shaved noodles. You can actually make those at home by making a simple dough out of water and wheat flour and then literally shaving the resulting dough into hot water to cook it. But here I've just got some dried ones, nice and simple, just as good. Once your noodles are cooked, just strain them through a sieve and then rinse them quickly with cold water so they don't stick. And when your soup's done, take as many of those hard spices out as possible because you do not want to bite into them. Grab a couple of serving bowls and each one add one tablespoonful of citron chili oil. Now I actually have a recipe for this on my blog tashcakes.com. Just search citron chili oil on my blog tashcakes. Maybe I'll make a video for that. And now I'm adding half a teaspoonful of black vinegar. One teaspoonful of sesame oil, this is toasted sesame oil. Now I'm just adding the noodles on top and spooning over that lovely fragrant soup. Top with some chunks of beef, which by now is super tender. And don't forget those onions, add a bit of those too. And I also like to add some steamed choy sum. Sprinkle over some freshly chopped coriander and spring onions and we are done! Thanks for watching and or listening, I hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope you'll join me next Wednesday for my next one. Get full recipes for all of these videos on my blog tashcakes.com and find me on Instagram as tashcakestastes. Subscribe and hit the notification bell if you'd like to see more, comment down below if you'd like me to make anything in particular, and I'll see you guys later. Stay safe, be nice, and have a good week.